I met my best friend Courtney, um, and she was his Children's Miracle Network Hospital champion child in 2009 for the state of Vermont, and she changed my life. I met her in seventh grade, and I met her on a field trip. We were partnered together, and I noticed that she was actually taking a little bit longer than the other kids. We were hiking um, a mountain, which is a very common thing to do for a field trip in Vermont, and we were hiking, and she was really lagging behind, and I was the only one that stayed behind um, and kept her company. And she ended up telling me at the very end of the field trip that she was terminally ill with cystic fibrosis. And that's why she was having a hard time hiking. And she hadn't told anybody. She had just moved to the school a year ago. Um, and it was because she was bullied in her previous school about her illness. And she had moved to Colchester where I went. And she hadn't told anybody because she didn't want to be bullied again. And so I was the only person who knew for about a year that she was sick. And she would disappear for times and then come back. And kids were wondering where Courtney went. And it was because she went to the Vermont Children's Hospital, which is a Children's Miracle Network hospital. And I had the absolute pleasure of visiting her there multiple times. We had so much fun going there. I would hang out with her on the weekends. We would go there. I would help her with home homework and do stuff with her there and it really wasn't like she was in a hospital. They had so many you know fun things to do, movies, games, we went to the teen room a lot, we played foosball and air hockey and fun stuff like that and we even used little kid like carts <laughs> a lot. We like would sit in the carts and use them for fun and drag each other around but that's how I met Courtney and that's also how I got involved with the Miss America organization was through Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. Courtney has had such an amazing impact on me. She is my everything in a way. She is the reason I'm sitting here today. She's the reason I went and studied what I did. She's the reason I went to the school where I went to because I wanted to be close to her because with cystic fibrosis, although Children's Miracle Network provides the best care they can for her, it is a terminal illness. And so right now she is waiting for a double lung transplant um, through Mass General down in Boston, um, but we don't know if that's gonna happen. And so they provide care for her to keep her alive. And she has affected me in so many ways. I think the reason I got involved with MAO is because of her. She, I went with her, she was <laughs> nervous to talk as a champion child to the Miss Vermont 2009 contestants um, about why they raise money for CMNH. And I went with her because she was nervous and she's like, you're good at talking, just come with me. So I went with her and I actually had Laura Hall, who was Miss Vermont 2009, pull me aside and say, I think you'd be really good for this program. And so, you know, here I am, Miss Vermont, 2018, almost 10 years later, um, took me five years to win, but every year I went back because of people like Courtney. It didn't matter if I was disappointed or heartbroken that I didn't win because I knew every time I stepped on that stage, I represented a Children's Miracle Network child. I represented Courtney and I represented everybody who needed a lung transplant. And my voice allowed those organizations to come to the forefront and be heard, which is so important. And that's so much more important than me winning a title. And so now that I have this title, that's what my focus is. It's sharing Courtney's story, because in a way, Courtney was never able to win Miss Vermont, even though she wanted to so badly. So I am Miss Vermont, and she's Miss Vermont at the same time. And we share in this journey together because she's too sick. She's in the hospital too often. She couldn't you know, hold this job, but I can share, and we can share in this journey together.